We live Ricky. Once again, <clears throat> I'm your motherfucking host. Da da da. Y'all know what time it is. You know what I'm saying? We are the motherfucking A Leaf. So I'm um, just um, want to come to y'all and talk to y'all about um, the beginning foundations of the psychological, mental makeup of myself and a lot of people. I want to share that with you guys. So. Really early, uh, say five, six years old, being that my grandmother taught me a lot with the Bible, reading a lot of Bible when I was young, I understood the concept of the concept of heaven and hell, how people want to interpret it. So let's just say the concept of heaven is being close to the God, something good, and the concept of hell being outside the presence of God. In my mind, once I understood that, Spiritually, mentally, psychologically, all I could think about is getting to heaven, as I would think most most people would, would too. So in doing so, I realized and I came up with the understanding that I cannot sacrifice my number one most precious gift, my spirit, my life. I cannot sacrifice that at all. So I have to guard it with everything I, I can. And being and understanding that and thinking that way, I refuse to let ignorance or allow lack of knowledge be the reason why I'm condemned to hell. So because of that, I I yearn for knowledge and I thirst for wisdom because I know that's gonna be my salvation. I, I look for information and knowledge and stuff that's gonna allow me to make the right decisions to be able to get to the promised land. That's the basic foundation of my uh, 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 reasoning and thinking. So because of that, I was not going to allow myself to be led astray by any man. Don't care who you are. Because no man in my mind is responsible for my spirit. Not Jesus, not Muhammad, not Buddha, nobody. I am responsible for my spirit and me getting into in the to the closer to God, the presence of God. And I realized in the life journey that getting closer to God is not something that you do really only after life. This is a, a journey in this phase that you have to do. So getting close to God is acquiring knowledge, is being able to be decipher, you know, a decide, have a discernment of what's going on and having a third eye. All these things you have to have to navigate to be able to get to uh, the promised land or get to heaven or get to the, closer to the presence of God. Because if it tells you ignorance is what kills or have held its people in, in bondage. So understanding that I wish not to be ignorant and I wish not to lead unto any other man's understanding or thoughts or ideology. I am responsible for myself and if I go to hell, I am going to be responsible for, responsible for that. Not any other man. Not Jesus, not Muhammad, not the president, not the Pope. Nobody but myself. Thank you for tuning in for this brief moment and this brief uh, 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 lesson that we have to go through. Uh, once again, this is A-Leaf Radio. My name is Da 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 Da. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Thank you.